What to do YouTube? I'm Jam for Life here, and uh, I'm here with Maria. It's actually Maria's birthday today. Hi, I'm 21. Woo! Uh, so um, I decided to get some quick battles, a quick video, and before uh, we went out and partied and stuff. So um, here's a couple battles I had. So I'm um, looking at this guy's team. This guy's team is real serious, and uh, I wasn't really sure what to lead off with. I think I ultimately decided to lead off with uh, Zeb Stryka, uh, just to gauge what kind of player he was. And uh, because I knew he was going to lead off with Politoed because obviously he's going to lead off with Politoed. So I decided to lead off with Zep Stryko. Then I was going to click um, Hidden Power Ice, but I was like, eh, I don't want him to not go into Landorus and then I just look stupid. So I'm just going to click Volt Switch because if he goes into Landorus, I do have Bronze on to uh, take take it on. So I'm not really worried about that. So I was like, nah, there's no reason to overpredict so early. So I'm going to go for the Volt Switch. And uh, he actually does end up staying in. So that was a good... Uh, on my part so that and seeing how much damage I, that did I know that he's choice in some way maybe scarf which is why he stayed in um, that would make much make a lot of sense because um, I, I thought that my Zeb striker was modest I mean it was uh, tim or timid so that did a lot of damage so I went to Vaporeon expecting the water move then I went for Scald knowing nothing on the team really wanted to take it then this Latios hits me with a side shot and it does a lot of damage so I'm just gonna protect here um, <clears throat> to uh, take the side shot then I didn't want to switch into bronze on I thought that was kind of obvious so I actually thought, I, th I predicted him to go for the surf here, so I was like, I'll just call it, um, hoping he over the hits. And um, if he doesn't, I know I can live at least one more to side shock, as long as he doesn't crit me, and then hopefully I get a burn. So he's going to side shock me, I take that, um, and I get, uh, I do get the skull burn on him, so I'm like, yes, alright. So now I'm, I'm going to protect, uh, but then he goes for recover, and I'm like, okay, that's not good. So um, looking at the way he's playing, he's not, he's playing pretty straight up, so I know he's going to go for another side shock. And switching to bronze on, take that pretty easily. And I didn't want to mess around with this Latios, so I just decided to go straight for Gyro Ball instead of uh, Stealth Rocks. And I'm going to take this Latios out. So that's one threat gone. And bronze on still had a good amount of HP. So now he goes in Jirachi. I didn't want this to be the sub called mine, Jirachi, and I didn't want him to give a free sub, so um, I'll go for the Earthquake. And he, he shows me Stealth Rocks, so I'm like, okay, uh, maybe he's the physical set, so I'm going to go for Stealth Rocks. But he Thunderways me, paralyzes me as I went for Stealth Rocks there, and gets the para attack. So I'm like, okay, well, he's probably going to Thunder again. Um, so I'm going to go into Landorus, but he goes for Calm Mind. I'm like, okay, as long as he doesn't have water. I, I, be, I should be able to take one Water Pulse, because it's probably bulky, and he crits me with Psychic. And that's the second time, second uh, game in a row my Landorus got crit with Psychic, which is kind of annoying. So now I'm in trouble, because Landorus was really crucial for his team, especially for his Terrakion. Uh, but Landorus and Bronzong could take on Terrakion and Landorus, his own Landorus, pretty easily. But now, uh, that's not the case. And so now I have to go into uh, Latias and just roar him out of here, because I really can't do much to him at this point. And uh, he gets another paralysis, and he goes out into this Terrakion, and um, look, but that's fine. Um, I, I don't want to switch directly into Bronzong again. I think that's kind of obvious. Um, so I'm just going to go for the Dragon Pulse to um, just the scout was going to do. I am max defense, so I know I can take one hit. Goes for Rock Slide. Doesn't do much, but he flinches me. So uh, he's got the para flinch going on. Then he Swords Dances, and I go for Recover, and I'm like, okay, uh, this is bad. So my plan, my plan was... Uh, he, um, knowing his, um, you know, his standard play style, uh, I know he's going to go for another Rock Slide. Bronzong should be able to take that. And then I just hope that he kills me uh, with the, um, the Hidden Power, the, the Close Combat. So I can, my plan was to go into Zeb Striker, me first to Close Combat, and then kill him off. Um, hoping that he didn't choose to go for the uh, Rock Slide over that. Because uh, that's really the only thing I can do at this point. So now he's subbing up, trying to get some hacks. I mean, he's got enough hacks. And then he finally gets the hacks. And he also gets the select very boost. So uh, it, it, it served two functions. So now he can Close Combat me. And, um, and, uh, and kill me, finish me off. So now I just have to hope I don't get paralyzed because I know I can take one rock fight still, even with plus two. And I do take it, don't get paralyzed, but break the sub. And then uh, I'm gonna have to, I mean, I, I mean, I can't do much, so I'm just gonna go for Dragon Pulse again. No, I'm gonna die because he's gonna kill me with close combat. That's fine. So now I'm like, okay, I'll just go into Zap Striker, me first. Even if he close, or even if he rock fights, I should be able to take finish him off but I still nice like I'll just both switch but he ends up outspeeding me and I'm like wait a second how does he how does he how is he faster than me my base speed is 116 his is 108 so he must be um jolly and I was like wait I had to go back and check but, but um, um and I was like okay so this is showing you that um my zip striker is adamant it's not timid so that's the reason why he upset me if he was jolly then he would be able to outspeed me and then I was like, uh, I was going to switch it, but I was like, there's no, re like, choice, I mean, Select Berry to Rakion is, like, just one random thing. If I had all my Pokemon, I could take it, so I don't really need to switch it back to, switch it to Timid. So, okay, now this is going up against the Rain Stall team. Figured that he would lead off with his Politoed or his Rotom, so I'm going to go for the, um, Stealth Rocks here, and, um... I'm, I'm expecting him to either just straight switch out into Fortress or Volt switch out into Fortress. Or, um, so I'm going to go to Latias. Latias can take his hits either way. And I'm going to hit him power fire. Mm -hmm. That thing, he got a crit rap spin, which did like 
5%. And, uh, now I'm just gonna Dragon Pulse. Um, he can go into Plow Politoe, that's fine. Uh, now what I'm gonna do is, I uh, wanted to switch into Vaporeon, but just in case he got Toxic, I, I think I decided to go into Bronzong and just get my rocks up again. And that would, um, again, once again, force his Fortress to switch in and Rabbit's been basically doing nothing. So he did go for the Toxic, but that was a good play on my part. And now, I'm, now I'm just gonna <laughs> Stealth Rock again. No, he's gonna Skull, but I'm especially defensive, so I can take that for days. And now I'm gonna switch into my Vaporeon to take the Skull, because he's obviously gonna go for Skull. And then my plan was to uh, switch into Zep Striker to take the Toxic, because I didn't really want my Vaporeon to be Toxic. So I'm going to go into Zep Striker here. And uh, I'm ex uh, so he goes for the Toxic like I thought he would. Now I'm expecting his D Doug Trio to come in, so I'm going to hit and Power Ice. But he ends up going for Protect. I'm like, ah, I should have seen that coming. Uh, the thing about Rain Stallers is that they play, they play extremely, extremely obvious. So he's going to Protect, you know, just get some more Poison damage. He's going to go for it. Now he's going to go into his Fortress just to die. So I guess that was a good switch, because um, if, I, if I could switch up my moves... Um, then that that would um, that would uh, rack up more poison damage on him. Also, um, you know, seeing what I locked myself into. But now he's gonna go into his road. I'm gonna protect here because I'm figuring that he's probably scarf. I haven't seen an item yet, but since he's directly switched out on my bronze, on that's kind of telling me that he's choice in some way. So now I'm gonna double switch into the Zep Striker. He predicts that pretty nicely and goes into his uh, Politoed. I'm not gonna mess around and go for the Volt Switch because I just know he's gonna protect and at this point I'm like okay he doesn't have a Wisher so I'm just gonna let my Vaporeon get Toxic so I can Toxic his Politoed and then I'll just wish because he can't recover his health but I can so this is, he's gonna die eventually. And then I was, I was gonna click Wish then I decided not to and I was like I'll just click Wish whatever. Um, so he goes for Parasong, I really don't know why, but now I'm just going to switch into my Bronzong and get that back up to full HP, just so that I can take on his Salamence, because that's really the only thing on his team that I'm actually worried about. Well, that and Doug Trio, because I don't want him trapping my Vatini or my Zip Striker. So now he's going out in the Jellicent, going to switch back into Vaporeon, hoping he didn't have Taunt, but uh, he did have Taunt, so I kind of just switched into Vaporeon just to scout and see if he did have Taunt. Now I'm going to switch into Latias, because Jellicent's kind of a problem. Then he shows me Ice Beam, and that, that was a crit, I think. Um, no, it wasn't a crit, but it didn't do anything. I know he's going to Toxic me, so I just roar him out and do a Salamence. And here, I should have just went for Dragon Pulse, because he doesn't know that my Latias isn't max speed, so he's obviously going to switch out, but I double switched into Landorus, um, expecting him to, I don't know, outrage me. Now, I'm just going to, like, I'm, I just want to Toxic this thing. I don't really think Landorus is going to be that important, um, because I do have Bronze on for the Salamence, and he Ice Beams me, and it doesn't even kill, and that's times four, so... Landers is a beast when it's out, you know, bulky Landers is pretty good. So now, uh, I was going to Earthquake, but I'm like, there's no reason to let my Landers die. So I'm just going to U-turn out into Latias because I can take whatever move he has. He's going to Ice Beam me. He doesn't do anything, so I'm not really worried about it. Now I'm going to recover, and I believe uh, he also chooses to recover right here. Yeah, he does. So I'm just like, well, I'm going to win this battle because um, I've, st I've, I've, um, I've turned behind him as far as Toxic. So he's going to switch into his Politoed. Um, that's fine by me. I'm just going to go into Vaporeon because Vaporeon can take Politoed all day. And as I said before, Rain Stallers, they play extremely obvious. So what I'm going to do here, go for the Wish. He's probably going to Protect or just um, straight, straight up switch out into Rotom. It's probably the two options that he really has at this point. And he's thought about it for quite some time. Decided to go to Rotom and that's fine. And what I'm going to do here is Protect. See what move he locks himself into. And uh, if, if he, you know I mean, knowing him, he's probably going to go for the... Um, Hydro Pump. He can't Volt Switch because I do have the Zep Striker and he is choice. And the fact that he went for Hydro, Point on my, Hydro Pump on my Vaporeon kind of revealed to me that he is um, choice Scarf most likely with his team. So now um, he's just going to try and stay in the Hydro Pump me all the way down. And I'm just going to keep recovering up. <laughs> um, basically here, I was, I mean, there's a chance that he'll miss Hydro Pump. You know, I was banking on that chance, but you know, it's me. So he's probably not going to miss. But I figured, you know what, I really don't need Latios too much. And um, I can just um, take on whatever he wants to go for. But I decided to just go back and I was like, wait, I have Vaporeon. He's locked in his Hydro Pump. Why don't I just switch this back in? So now I know he's going to go for the Taunt because, as I said before, Rain Stallers play extremely obvious. So what I'm going to do is go into Zeb Striker, expecting his Taunt. I, he's not going to Scald me. And all he can do really is Ice Beam me if he's going to attack or go for the recovery. Uh, but I, I, he's pretty sure he's probably he's most likely going to go for the Taunt just because he doesn't want me to wish again. So that's probably, that's probably his priority to stop me from wishing. And he does go for the Taunt. So now I'm, I know his Dark Trio is going to come in. There's no way he's going to keep his gelatin in. So I'm going to go for the Hidden Power Ice, expecting the Dark Trio to come in. And it does come in. And I'm surprised that actually didn't kill because Dark Trio's um, defenses are not that great. And uh, that didn't kill. So Zip Striker, you're kind of weak, man. But it's still, you're still cool, though. So it's all good. So kill the Dark Trio with a crit that completely mattered. So uh, because of that hack, he's going to lose the game. And uh, now he's going to go back into his Rotom. Um, and uh, here he actually makes a really good play here. He goes for the Volt Switch. Uh, I mean, he goes for the Thunder, which um, 
it, it looks strange, but he, I mean, I guess at this point he figured that I must, I have to be Scarf because I outsped the Duck Trio, so he, I'm pretty sure he didn't think I would stay in on a Hidden Power, but now I double switch, expecting the Salamence to come in, um, and I'm just going to Volt Switch out. I know that he knows that I have Hidden Power Ice now, so he's going to go into Jellicent, I'm going to Volt Switch, and then I'm going to go out into Victini and uh, start the destruction because um, I was going to U-turn, but I didn't think it would kill, so I said, I'll just fuck it, I'll just Volt Strike and kill that thing off, and um, he's pretty much lost at this point, and he's just going to quit, so that was um, some quick battles. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'm out of here. Deuces. Deuces.